Okay, this is the Arcade Classic section of this arcade. Uh, 616 games. Uh, first up is uh, 1945, Arrow Fighters. Airwolf is a classic. Try to go through this as quickly as I can. Um, <clears throat> Battle Toads. Um, let's see. So just going through the bees. Uh, there's Burger Time. And <clears throat> when it plays, it's the original ROM set, so. So it's the original graphics from, in this case, 1984, I think. Or maybe 1982, what I just said. Uh, Centipede, another classic. Uh, Cheeky Mouse. Defender. Um, that's in a lot of uh, arcades. Dig Dug 1, Dig Dug 2. Donkey Kong. Again, so it starts up with the Donkey Kong noise. Put credit, credit, and there's the Donkey Kong, and it's original ROM set, so it's playing exactly how it would play. Here's the subwoofer. All right, I can't play one-handed. <laughs> I want to. Um, Donkey Kong 3, just going through here. Dynamite Duke, F1 Grand Prix. Galaga, that's a classic. Gauntlet, what this thing has? Gorf, <laughs> my gosh. <laughs> Through and the H's now. So this would be the first Pac-Man. It's Hyper Pac-Man, not nearly as popular as the originals, but it's there. Everything's in alphabetical order. Yeah, we're coming up on Joust and Joust Two. Kick Rider. Never heard of that. Lord of Gun. <laughs> Mario Brothers. So they have original Mario Brothers from Nintendo. And there it is. That's awesome. Coin. There you go. Demonstration. Oh, it's giving me the demonstration first. I haven't played this on here. Okay, play. Oh, jeez. All right. Millipede. Mr. Dew. Mr. Dew's castle. Nibbler. Playing a lot of that with that documentary on Netflix, Man vs. Snake. P47, another classic. Okay, so Pac Land, Pac Man. There's your original. Is this your original Pac Man? 1981. Yep. It's doing that because that's how the ROM set started. And then you'd hit the coin button. There you go. All 
I'm not any good at this game, especially while trying to film myself playing it. Okay, <clears throat> Peekaboo, Pirates, Pit Fighter, let's see, Popeye, Punch-Out! This is the original arcade version of Punch-Out. They've got Punch-Out on the Nintendo on here too. Raiden, that's another kind of classic. Here's Rampage, original Rampage World Tour. This is great. Sky Alert. Space Invaders. Spider-Man. I don't know if I know that one. Or Super Punch Out, a sequel. Tech Mobile for the arcade. There's a classic. Some of these, some of these I've never heard of. Versus Super Mario Brothers. Oh, cool. Super Mario Brothers. That'd be in the Nintendo section too. World Stadium. Okay. Zip Zap. Okay. So that's the 616 arcade. Uh, Capcom, these would be the old school Capcom games, like 1943, whereas these would be more of the original. The CPS 3 or Capcom Play System 3 would have like, uh, like this is Second Impact from Street Fighter 3 Second Impact. So this would be, this is going to look a lot better, you know, graphically because this is 15 years later. Fifty cent game. Select your super Hear the sub in this one really go out. I can't play it. I can't play one handed. But you can see that the controls are pretty responsive. Zero delay. Okay, uh, Capcom Play System 2 and 1. Uh, Data East, and this will have some older games on it. That's right. Guy asked if they had Marvel on here. Marvel Superheroes vs. Street Fighter. Uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Clash of Superheroes. And then you've got the Street Fighter 2's Turbo. And on this one, Play System 1, you'll have the earlier Street Fighter 2's, including Championship Edition. Some other classics that weren't on the, the classic list, including Frogger, their ripoff version of <laughs> Donkey Kong, and the classic Puck Man, which is essentially the early version of Pac Man. They changed the name from the US. Rem, some more, some more classics. Um, Kung Fu Master would probably be the the big one here. Konami. This will have your Contras, your original Contra there for the arcade. 
Oh, they got Black Panther. G.I. Joe. And Gradius. Yep. Sunset Riders, that is, that is a classic. Really cool to have Sunset Riders. And then uh, Konami's got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. There's Turtles in Time, and then there's the regular one. Midway, um, Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 3, 2, and then they have MGM. NBA jams and they have different versions on different dates because the company tried to keep up with trades and things that happen because obviously if a player was on a certain team it would get outdated there's Mrs. Pac-Man or Miss Pac-Man under the Pac-Man logo Pac-Man Plus Another not so common, more or less computer game system. This is popular because of the Striker series, which is basically like 1943. And the Tetris game. This is the Sega Arcade, not the Sega Home. So, a lot of semi-popular stuff. Golden Axe, probably the, one of the legendary classics there. Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. <laughs> and then Pitfall, Shinobi. And there's Tetris. Transformers. Okay. Set a system. Don't know too many of these games. A lot of these are overseas. Thundercade. This would be the last of the arcade series. The rest of them are bust to move. 141 in this Daria, yeah. There's a few in here. Operation Wolf. Very cool. I wonder if it plays because I, we don't have a gun. Rambo 3, cool. Some of these, like Outrun, won't won't play because you don't have a wheel, but it, it's on here in case you ever do get one. Okay, so Game Boy Advance and then Game Boy Color, Neo Geo, or these are all your your Game Boy games, and these are obviously on here not for graphic reasons, but just for nostalgia. Neo Geo, this was. Came out in like 1990. Metal Slug. Oh, this is the pocket one. Let's go to the regular Neo Geo. I must have accidentally gone. You can go over in the subcategory too on accident. Bust a move. Fatal Fury. There'll be a lot in here. King of Monsters. Metal Slug. This is Metal Slug is one of my favorites. I think it has all five plus the super vehicle ones. Just take a little bit to get going here. Here we go. Plays that. That's the original ROM. So it. Now the Neo Geo arcade. You only had four controllers or four buttons. Mission 
I could play this all day one handed. That's cool. Sound is great on it. Okay, getting out of that. Samurai Showdown. Oh, sorry. Hold this up. King of Fighters. Look at that. All the way up to 2003. I think this is every Neo Geo game on the available on the system. Nintendo, uh, every every Nintendo game um, on the system. So if you Played it on the Nintendo, it's available on this. Including, I can jump to S for Super, Super Mario. It'll go a lot fat. Oh, is that Dragon Warrior? There's Dr. Mario. But yeah, you get the idea. Excite Bikes on here. Just crazy. Let's go to S. There's a Rampage version of that. Look at your Super Mario Brothers. Super Mario Brothers Duck Hunt World. There we go. There we go, play. And on this system, you only have to worry about A and B. There's only two buttons on that system. Again, I'm trying to play it one-handed while filming. Anyway. So, yeah, it's got one, two, and three. Pretty much everything you can think of. It's cool, it's got the art on there too. Super Nintendo, same deal. It's got the art, a screenshot, and... As you can see, all the games. You could pretty much look up a list of those games. Super Famicom would be games that were released in Japan, um, but then brought over here uh, and translated. Only one Nintendo 64 game, just Super Mario 64. Um, Nintendo DS, Sega, same deal. Just everything from if you had a sega genesis as a kid i didn't but if you did i was a nintendo one kid but uh they're all on here genesis 32x turbo graphics virtua boy I, it's commodore 64 only one game what virtua boy was that silly nintendo system that can't be taking up a lot of room. PC Engine, that would be games that you bought on your PC that were available. So arcade, console, even PC are on here. A lot of these are Japanese. And then all games, if you kind of go through like, here's 1942, that would be the arcade version and then this would be the Game Boy Color version. This would be the NES version. So really, kind of your entire childhood is in here. And then back to arcade. You can do your last played and you can keep favorites if you want. Um, it's kind of a rundown of what's what's on the system. All right.